So I feel like on this question, you might not be putting it in the right form. So what you have to notice is this says it's in standard form, which is AX plus BY and then your number goes on the other side. So like if you look at the red, um, I'm going to write it in slope intercept form first. So it is plus one for the intercept and then you're right. The slope is one and then to the right two. And then if we have Y and we know we're shading above, so it's going to be greater. So it looks like you have those ideas here, but I don't know where you got that from. So we need to get rid of the two. So you're going to multiply all terms by two to get it in standard form. So two Y is greater than those cross out X plus two. And then we want to get um, the X by itself. I uh, said so the X and Y alone. So we can subtract Um, and there's a couple of different forms. They have the x first, so negative 1x plus 2y. Um, but what you also usually notice is that usually you have this um, first coefficient be positive. So if you multiply everything by negative 1, we would end up with 1x minus 2y. That does switch the symbol. And negative 2. So I would probably go with this. I think the answers are um, coded, so you could have either of those since it doesn't say, but that's what you want to do. I am not sure. It looks like you kind of did the same thing here, um, and you guessed maybe, but same idea. So your intercept is negative 5. We know our slope is up 1, 2 to the right 1. We are shading under there, so we're going to have y is less than or equal. Um, and then same idea, you want to get these um, to the same side. So we've got y minus 2x. I would multiply everything by negative 1. I'll write this first, sorry. And then usually the rules, we don't want that negative. So we're going to multiply everything by a negative 1 does switch our symbol. And so that's why that works. Okay. 